In this video, I'm going to show you how you can organize files into folders using Google Drive. Some of you are becoming really overwhelmed because you have so many documents listed here in My Drive. This video will show you four different ways that you can organize files into folders. Before we start organizing, we need to know how to create a folder. To create a folder, you're going to click on the Create button and you're going to go down to Folder. Go ahead and give your folder a name. I'm going to call mine Miscellaneous, but you may have a different name that you want to call yours, and click Create. Your My Drive list will expand to show you all of the folders that you have in My Drive. Here is the miscellaneous folder that we just cre created. It is open, so we see nothing in the folder because it's a brand new folder. We need to add some files to the folder. So I'm going to go back to My Drive list by clicking on My Drive. And I'm going to show you the first way to organize a file is actually from within the file itself. So I have a practice document here that I'm going to be working on, and you'll notice next to the name of the file, I have a folder icon. If I click on the folder, it will allow me to organize the document into a folder from right within the document. So this is similar to doing a Save As feature and selecting the folder that you want to put it in. I'm going to go ahead and put it in that new folder that I just created by clicking the checkbox in front of Miscellaneous, and I'm going to go ahead and click Apply Changes. Doing this moves the file from My Drive into the folder that you selected. Clicking on the folder will tell you that this item is a part of the miscellaneous folder. So I'm going to go back to My Drive list and we'll see that that file is no longer listed in My Drive. Instead, it's part of the miscellaneous folder. The next way we're going to look at organizing files is from within this drive list here. Um, you, there's three different ways that you can organize files from within this list. The first thing that I want you to do is make sure that you can see all of your folders over here. And to do that, if My Drive is closed, you want to click the little triangle to the left of My Drive and that will expand My Drive so that you can now see all of the folders that you have created. We're going to, in this method, we're going to move a file into one of our folders. So I'm going to click and drag on this document. Notice that when I start to drag, it says move practice document. This method will take the document out of my drive and move it into the selected folder. I'm going to put it into this miscellaneous folder. Once the folder I want to move it into is highlighted, I can release the mouse button and that will drop that file into that folder. You can see that that file is now no longer listed in My Drive, but if we open up the miscellaneous folder, that document will be listed there. So one way that you can organize your files is simply by clicking and dragging on the file and dropping it into a folder. This moves that file from My Drive into the folder that you selected. Another way that you can use the My Drive list to organize your files is by using the checkbox in front of every file in your list. If I click the checkbox in front of this document, that brings up a series of action items across the top of my screen. You'll notice that one of them is a folder, and if we hover our cursor over that folder, it says Organize. If I click on the folder, that's going to bring up all of the folders in My Drive, and it's going to allow me to select a folder to move that file into. This method takes the file out of My Drive and moves it into the selected folder. I'm going to select my folder, click Apply Changes. We'll see that that document is no longer listed in My Drive, but if we open up the miscellaneous folder, we will see that document. So using the checkbox method actually moves the file from My Drive to the folder you have selected. The final option you have for organizing files using the My Drive list is to add a file to a folder. Using Add leaves the file in My Drive and adds it to the folder you selected. So again I'm going to click and drag, but this time I'm going to hold down the control key on my keyboard while I click on the file name. So I'm going to hold the control key, I'm going to click on the file, and I'm going to start dragging. Now notice this time it says Add Practice Document not move like it did before. When we hold down the control key, it will add the document to a folder. I'm going to go ahead and select the folder. Once the folder is highlighted, I can release the mouse button and the control key, and that will add that file to the miscellaneous folder. Notice that it is still in my drive list, 
but I can tell that it is in the miscellaneous folder because it has a label here at the end of the file. If I open up the miscellaneous folder, I can see the file that I added, but I can also tell that this file is still in my drive because of the label here. So using the control key while you drag adds a file to a folder. This is the method that you want to use if you're reorganizing shared folders. Rather than moving them to your drive, you probably want to use the control key and add them to your drive. That way it doesn't move the file for other people that the folder might be shared with. So those are your four different methods for organizing files into folder using Google Drive.